Hi everyone, welcome back to another stream. Today we are playing a highly anticipated game. It just came out a couple months ago and it's called The Devil in Me because the devil made me do it. <laughs> Anyways. <laughs> the devil in me i think we're just gonna do lethal so we just say fucking do lethal for they have sown the wind and they shall reap the whirlwind hosiah 8 7 okay biblical biblical every choice has a consequence or some decisions save lives <laughs> Now why do I have to go and do that? Ew! The way that he's outlined like a wheel? The wheel is 264 <gasps> feet, Jeff. Can you imagine it? I'm attempting to. I bet you can see for 100 miles at the top. We should make that our first priority. Whatever pleases you the most. 1893? You mean you are not weary of me after an entire day of marriage? I will never be weary of you. I shall hold you to that, my dear. <laughs> I think we've arrived. Isn't this grand? As advertised. Very nice. Okay, Titanic. Let's check in. <laughs> so it's gonna pop, pop, pop. Try again. <gasps> now, is that a skeleton? Well, this does not bode well for the level of service we're in store for. Okay, let's see. Um, I'm just gonna say everyone must be busy elsewhere. Everyone must be busy elsewhere. That's no way to run a business. True though. Slow service. That means they're making sure everything. I mean, when I go to McDonald's, that's my. Memory. And there's no one at the drive-through. Always finding that silver lining. Oh, his face. Or. My sincere apologies oh. for both startling you and for making you wait. My attention was needed elsewhere. I promise from Ooh. here on out it will be nothing but silver. His lines. brows. Welcome to the World's Fair Hotel. What does that even mean? What is going Please. on? Sign in here. What is happening? First time in Chicago. I'm going to hazard Chicago. a guess and assume you're here to take in the exposition. Oh, yes, but that's not all. Today is a very Ooh. special day for us. She's losing her virginity today. Oh, a honeymoon. How very, very lovely. Perhaps my wife, Mrs. Whitman, would like to sign. <laughs> yes, today's the beginning of our honeymoon. Congratulations. World's Fair case, Hotel. An upgrade is in order. A honeymoon suite it is. Oh, well, uh, are the rates that much higher? <laughs> Something's going on here. I think nothing of it. The same rates as your regular room. The upgrade is on us. Mm. You're our first honeymooners. Why is he acting like that? Thank you, Mr. Holmes. Henry Howard Holmes. <laughs> you have a lovely hotel, Mr. Holmes. Well, thank you very much. I designed and built most of it myself. No way. You're an architect then? Architect, designer, builder. Lover. Doctor. Ooh. Artist. Ooh. I'm a man of many interests. <laughs> he definitely loves to get foot off. And gifts at the pharmacy counter. I'll take your luggage up to your room and ensure that everything is in order. Just <laughs> make a note if you decide to purchase anything, and we will add it to your bill. 
Now, hmm. what did I forget to bring? What is this? Era, era. Oh, pardon me, miss. Oh, careful, you. My husband gets awfully. Cold oh, not the role play. Hmm. He sounds like a ripe fellow. How's the marriage going? Lovely. Thanks for asking. Oh, Let's hell no. I'm sure the room is ready. See anything good over there at the jewelry counter? Anything fancy? Bitch, you just got a ring, though. You like to know. Wonder what's in here. I'm starting to think I've gone and married a thrill seeker. <laughs> Ferris wheels, forbidden rooms. Are we looking for excitement? Perhaps. Ooh. <sighs> Ooh! Nothing no. but an unfinished room. See what happens when you chase a thrill? If Why are they doing all this? Out of the Ferris wheel. I know you won't be denied. Wait, what's that? Oh, <laughs> girl, I don't want to know. <gasps> don't move. <laughs> Oh, quick time of it. Not gonna fuck up this time. Yeah, y'all better hush up. Y'all better hush up. I would lay in that mustache. I would lay in it. Oh, <laughs> sorry. I messed up oh, one gosh. time. I messed up one time. A wrong turn, it would seem. This room is being renovated. It's not safe. Of course. We Oh, you must have missed the sign saying private. Oh, must he's mad. We're very sorry. I can't have you falling through floors and having your brains dashed out, can I? He no. mad. Again, we apologize. <laughs> I think nothing of it. Ew. I'm only thinking of your safety. This man's a Didn't robot. Want you to get hurt. <laughs> Welcome, newlyweds, Ooh. to the honeymoon suite. The devil in me. Thank you kindly, Mr. Holmes. I don't like this man. Do enjoy your stay. If you'll excuse me, I have work. To return to. Yeah, this guy's a, this guy's a fucking NPC. I'm sure we'll see each other again soon. Oof. <laughs> oh my God, they're sneaky as the fuck, bro. This place is fit for a king. Or my queen. Oh you. <laughs> oh you. Kiss this. That is not very wifely of you. <laughs> hey. Ah. Bullseye! Oh, Sorry. I have something for you. Are you going to throw it at me? No. An actual gift. Close your eyes and face the mirror. Oh my god. Aren't you clever and romantic? If I get a pillow to the face, I will sock you right in the kisser. Is there a problem? No. Oh, he got her a necklace. Open your eyes. <gasps> it was oh, my great grandmother's. Lovely. I love it. Good. <laughs> Victory is mine. I'll let you have that bath now. <laughs> <gasps> Camera? Wait, but this is like the 1800s. <gasps> no. Why is she moaning like that? It's jammed shut. <laughs> She's moaning. Maybe if we put a little weight into it. 
open sesame. Why don't you have a shave while I take a quick bath? Then we can reconvene. I know that word. It's French for something illicit. <laughs> Shush. It's shave. French for do you want to have <laughs> sex? I my razor and kit. I'm sure the pharmacy downstairs has them. Don't be too long in that bath. Don't you worry. Okay, Jeff, we gotta go find a shaving kit. How do we get back down there? Is there an elevator in this hoe? I could have sworn this was the way we came up. Ooh. Is this one of those hotels that... Ooh. What? Ooh. What in the fuck? I didn't, I didn't know that was gonna happen. Come on, don't do all that. Oh my God. Damn! What is in there? Oh, there's some power that's gonna make her fall out. She just sniffed it. Are you about to see some titty? Hmm? <gasps> Hello? Is that you, darling? Jeff? Uh-oh. Oh, are we playing another game? Girl, no, I don't think so. Um, I think I need to investigate. Oh, I probably got her killed, though. Mr. Sneaky. You can't sneak up on me, Mr. Holmes. Hello, my dear. What are you doing in here? Jess! I don't think he can quite hear you. Get away from me! They're not finished yet. I said get. Ooh! He Don't sliced her. Oh! Will only hurt more if you do. <laughs> what? What are you? What have you done? Calm yourself, sir. I've seen your wife has had an accident. <gasps> she drowned in that tub. Is there a problem, sir? Damn. Ooh. He's running. He said, fuck my wife. Oh, not a gas chamber. Oh, not... Not a gas chamber? What the hell is going on? <laughs> oh my god. Come on, get up, Eileen! I'm Eileen? <laughs> Wait, what's her name? Marie? <laughs> oh my god, Marie! He's dying, bro. You're wasting your last chance to tell him that you love him. <laughs> Rest in peace to Marie Eileen. Oh my god. Oh! <laughs> Not his face looking like that. Oh my god. Wait, that was like really sad. A place for everything. Everything 
in its place. Wow, look at this. Oh, it's wonderful. They're gonna die too, man. You, my dear. Mother would simply die. It's so I say, opulent. good man, do you work here? They died virgins, bro. Hello. Welcome to the World's Fair Hotel. Oh. Ever seen one of these? They're very old. People used to call them obols. They'd put them in the mouth of the recently deceased to pay the ferryman. Who? Look out for them. Oh. You'll find them in the strangest places. I'll be happy to exchange any that you find. Oh. I'll certainly make it worth your while. We need to find those little, little coins. Here we go. My name is Kate Wilder. I've got a master's in criminal psychology. I'm an investigative journalist and hope to make a difference. You may have recently seen my interview on Chicago AM on... Uh, uh, and, uh, and, yeah, it's really tough when just being honest means everyone thinks you're a bitch. Oh, I'm not sure I've got issues to deal with, same as everyone. I I'm working on it. I... Hey, I'm Mark. I study photography. What is this? Way. Um... At a great time. Really want to get back into some serious photography. Uh, but yeah, it's a, it's a job. I've been a key grip and lighting test for years. See your problem. Is this bliss? <laughs> Sorry, do you start with qualifications or um like personal info? Because I don't, I mean, will anyone access this? I'm kind of private, actually. Uh, yeah, Charlie Lonitz, UK original. What the uh, fuck is this? 20 years. The last series was so on track. It was, uh, it was a very beautifully conceived and, um, didn't quite, uh, Ooh. Uh, mark, as I was hoping it would. It's a fucking mess, to be honest with you. Oof, oof, oof. I think we've heard quite enough. Enough? <gasps> <laughs> oh, I've barely begun, Your Honor. What's this? You don't seem to understand. I was born with the devil in me. Oh! <laughs> I could not help the fact that I was a murderer any more than a poet can help the inspiration to sing. No. <laughs> Bury me deep, Your Honor. Oh! Make sure they fill my pine box with cement. Put me deeper than anyone else. And cover the ground with more cement. Cause trust me. <gasps> Just being dead ain't enough to stop me from killing again. Oh. On May 7th, 1896, Herman Mudgett, a.k.a. Henry H. Holmes, was sent to the gallows. His neck did not snap from the force of hanging. Records indicate he hung slowly suffocating for over 15 minutes until finally the monster was dead wait i'm confused america's first serial killer confessed to 27 murders oh is he like a copycat but his investigators sifted through the traces he left behind following his path from city to city the number grew significantly nearly 200 lives america's first serial killer and possibly the worst He was buried as requested under concrete. Was he hoping to hide from God's judgment? Or did he truly want to keep the devil from climbing out and killing again? Ooh. Oh, this is a show. <coughs> so, what do you think? It's so awkward. To be honest, Charlie, <coughs> this is a pilot. Hold that thought. Lonnet Entertainment. Charles Lonnet, please. Speaking. Charlie is fine. My name is Grantham Dumet. What can I do for you, Mr. Dumet? Actually, it's what I can do for you. Hear me out. I'm certainly grateful to you, Mr. Dumet. This all sounds amazing, but I, uh, I just, I'm waiting to hear what the catch is. No offense. None taken. I'm in a privileged position. 
I don't need for much. But my time is- What is going on here? We need to do this today. I'll send a car for you this afternoon. 4 p.m. Be ready. This afternoon? We're talking a couple of days shoot. I've told my team they're free this weekend, and frankly, they're a temperamental bunch. Without them, this conversation <laughs> is dead in the water. So are these like students? I've told you what I have. Please don't waste my time. Am I sending the car or not? Yes. Are these students? Of course. We're in. I'll get them there. I promise. Let's do it. Let's do it. Mr. Dumet send you. We... Oh! Right. Let's load up, guys. I got it. I'm good. Yeah, are they actors? What's going on? Are they producers? Are they trying uh, to make a film? Are you? Oh! I mean, they are exes, lesbian I'm lovers. <gasps> Gloves? You're right. This is gonna be grand, people. You know what this just reminds me of? Don't say it. Topeka? Exactly. Me, no money in my pocket, a dead phone, and lost in the middle of goddamn Topeka. That wasn't my fault. It was 100% your fault. Because you fly by the seat of your ass. Oh. So, come on, Charlie. What do we know about this guy? He's Script. Rich. He's a recluse. He's obsessed with H.H. H. Holmes. Totally sane, I'm sure. We're going to a property he inherited from a relative. That's who had the obsession with Holmes. Mm. Some of the rooms are full recreations from the murder castle. Dumet has blueprints, documents, artifacts. Artifacts! This would save the show. I was not exaggerating. And you substantiated all of this? Just trust me. Sorry for all the mystery. <gasps> Before we go any further, I have to ask that we lock up your phones. No. While this may sound strange that I invite you to film the collection inside my home, I cannot allow any personal devices. No. To know about my this. business or lifestyle. There are rules. Fuck no. All footage you wish to use must be authorized by me. Turn that fucking call around. And his place, his rules. Look, what he's offering us is worth it. Could be making us pay, but he isn't. Well, that is a red That's flag in we itself. Are, we do. Fine. For the show. So they're making a show on H.H. H. Holmes. Telling you, this is going to be great. And they're trying to get more information. Okay, so now what? I'd love to get some footage of the lake and the scope of this. Not with all the mist and fog. There, from on high, we'll get a better look. Ooh. That's certainly um, up there. The, the visuals will be great and we can frame up over the mist. Charlie, you'll hack up a lung before you're halfway up there. I'm fit as a butcher's dog. Mark, this is crazy. I'm fit as a bitch's dog. Let's go, Charlie. Be careful, guys. Nice knowing you. Come on. Run, bitch. <clears throat> Warning, cliff erosion. Let's jump. All right, let's fucking go. Oh, look at him mantling. It's like Fortnite. Ooh. In memory of the victims of the great storm of May 1st, 1907. <laughs> Hey, when we wrap, I'd like to take a couple weeks off. Go see my family. I need you in post. Oh. I really appreciate that concerning eye of yours. Tonight. He just asked to go see his I'm family. What's going on at the moment, Charlie? Oh, right. Yeah, of course. Sure. Take a couple of weeks. Get your head together. He was on back about let this man go see his family. Damn, this is like a full ass hike. Oh, the crow. <laughs> Christ, what the hell is that? A mannequin, you know. Hanging out. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Okay, that was fucking scary. Jesus, why are we crawling? All this just go to the White House? The White House. <laughs> the lighthouse? Look at him running. Oh. 
Ooh, what is this? This looks pretty old. <gasps> oh, it's one of those things. What's that? Just some old coin. Find the penny. Get up. Ooh, balls. It's locked. Fuck. Oh, I see. I need to get up there. Oh, interesting. Interesting. Okay, this this element was not in the other games. Okay, here we go. Okay, now we're climbing into this lighthouse. <coughs> Just a little breaking and entering. Oh. Christ, what the hell is that? What? Hide? Hello? Oh my god. What the fuck was that? Did y'all hear that hiss? Oh, this is like a house. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Charlie, I'm getting an uneasy feeling about this. Somebody has a text to me, hobby. Relax. <laughs> Some hobby. Damn, they're hopping in a puffin. It's gonna be okay. It's all gonna be okay. Look at this. It's perfect. Come on, get shooting. I want you to pan across the lake until the island comes into shot. Then zoom into that lighthouse. <gasps> Something's going fucking. Something's going to fuck up, pop out at me. Look, it's all right. Come on, we better get back. Are you kidding? We just got here. He was there for two seconds. He didn't even take any photos. Got him? I don't know. <clears throat> we just had the one call. How, how did he know what our show was about in the first place? Uh, actually, I didn't ask. That's weird. Let's just play nice, okay? This is weird. This is weird. Who's this? Hello, Mr. Lonnet. That's me. I'm Grantham Dumet. Everyone climb aboard and we'll head out. This is Mark. Mark. Erin. Jamie. Ladies. And this is Kate. Pleased to meet you, Mr. Dumet. I'm looking forward to seeing all it is you have to offer. We truly appreciate this. Lovely to meet you all. What say we get underway? Why are they smiling like that? Let's get up to the hotel. Uh, please, let's stay close. Stick together. Is it dangerous here? No. <laughs> you sure? Because you don't seem sure. It's perfectly safe. But we are a long ways from help if somebody gets hurt. So oh, please, take care. I'm scared. Looks like things are buttoned up tight around here. God. This way. Don't worry about your bags. I'll make sure. This is right. so weird. Why does he want them in so bad? I want to say I'm annoyed. I'm not exactly dressed for a hike, Mr. Dumet. It's just a short walk. It won't take long. You're right. He takes his security very seriously. Oh. I wonder what he's afraid will get in. Maybe you should be asking what he's trying not to let out. Jamie. Ooh. Just saying. You watch too many horror movies. He values his privacy. He values his privacy. We've known that for about two hours. Just go. Mark, get your camera. I want to grab a quick intro from here. I need some shots leading up to the house. Don't need the whole journey. Kate, talking to camera, then I'll direct you from there, okay? No photos. No recording oh my of God. me at all. Is that clear? I'm a very private He's person. a ghost, that's why. He won't Don't show up on the film. Discretion is Lonnet Entertainment's motto. You want the usual intro stuff, Charlie? Please. The light is good. I'm ready to go, Aaron. It sounds clear. Okay, let's go for a tech then. Is Kate's face ready? Bitch, I'm always camera ready. Stop trying to make me like you. Ooh! Rolling. Speed. And action. Lesbians I've be just like. just arrived on the private island which claims to have genuine artifacts from H.H. Holmes' reign of terror. I'm heading to the house right now. <gasps> 
Perfect, Kate. Now turn to face the house and start to walk. OK, that's enough. And cut. We really do need to get going. Why is he Anything rushing? Turns, this way. You'll steal some more shots, right? Obviously. I'm scared. <gasps> what the fuck? This to do med is being really restrictive. I noticed. I want you to get a look around without him knowing. A man is entitled to his privacy. He's caging. I want to know what he's trying to hide. What do you want to do? What you did that time with those cops in Glendale. Seriously? I'm scared. Ah, ow! Oh my, damn it! What happened? You okay? Did you get your baby ego again? Oh, we should get her up to the hotel. Oh my, I can barely move it. Jamie, stay with her. Why me? Because you know first aid. Remember how you patched her up in Glendale? Oh, right. OK. We'll find some oh, ice in the and come back. You have that at the hotel? Yes, sure. Then let's go. What is going on? Come on. I'll clue you in later. What's Charlie want? A better lay of the land. And we're the scouts because? I'm charming. And you can hotwire They're going to kiss. Security. Come on. Now we got to explore. As y'all know, I'm not really the exploring type in these games, but we'll try. Uh, Why are they doing this? You should have told us to dress for a trek. Okay. <laughs> oh my God, I wasn't even paying attention. There we go. Do you live out here on the Hide? Oh shit. With your family? Fuck shit. Q. 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 Mr. Dumet, is this an actual palm tree? Was this shipped into the island? I... I don't think so. Mr. Dumet is uneasy as fuck. So, where the fuck are we now? Oh, look, it's a train. Now what? How lesbians get down on one knee to propose. <gasps> what about over there? Damn, they'll do anything for some B-roll. I know, these bitches are sweating. She got a beanie on and a jean jacket? Like, what okay. is this? If I can get the car moving and stop it here, we'll be able to get across. Oh. You see the control panel? It's trashed. I don't even think there's power. Explore the island, get power to the control panel. Okay, so we need to get over here. Oh, damn, another one of these tokens. Now what? Uh oh, here we go. Now why are we doing this? Maybe we can get this thing working. Explore the island, move the train car? Jamie, can you fix this? Come on, Jamie. Oh, the wiring here is ancient. Follow the arrows and don't go out of sequence. Why is her hand looking like a zombie hand? Bitch, you are lying. Okay, my mouse is not working. No, you don't turn them all on. <gasps> Bitch, I wake up. No styling. Ha! God damn, I'm brilliant. Okay, here we go. One trolley coming up. One trolley coming up. Thank you. One trolley coming up. The way she's just going like this is just sending me. Hear that? <gasps> It's the guy that's gonna eat you alive. Oh, hide? Q. Hello. Wonder who you are. Did I not Q? <laughs> Why is she getting on her knees like that? Oh. Oh, shit. Oh, God, that's so much better. I guess I just needed to rest it for a minute. I think I'm okay. You found a shortcut up the hill. I really need you to stay where I say. You got it, Mr. Dumet. We're all here now. Let's head on. Let's Everyone head stay on. Stay under the watchful eye of Mr. Dumet, please. Kate. What do you think? We didn't find anything, by the way. Summer camp from hell. Whatever. 
We're going to find out what's up his sleeve before too long. Don't worry about that. Coming or what? Uh -huh. He's afraid of bridges. You afraid of heights? Maybe. Oh shit! We're all gonna die! <sighs> Just go. <laughs> oh my god, relax, Mark. I'm gonna say, want a piggyback ride? Want a piggyback ride? Don't be an asshole. Give me your hand. Just your, give me your hand. Whoa, 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 so, Just so. get it over with. Come on, don't whistle. Wow, out. these bitches are un insane. Hmm? Was that so bad? Yes. There better be another way back down. Come on, princess. Where is everyone? Apologies, uh, they're all city folk. Come on, let's go. We're losing the day, people. Door is beautiful. This, wow, Mr. Dumas, this place is magnificent. Yeah. Maybe this won't be a waste of a weekend. They're staying there? No way. No way, love. He ain't fucking staying there, mate. Hello. I <gasps> who you are. What are you doing? <gasps> I, I saw a little girl up there. Bitch. Maybe it's your one fan. And now she's lost forever. Ooh. You're such a dick. They're gonna f by the end of this. Everything in here is fragile. Please be careful. Okay, why is this man so up in arms? I really want to know. Whoa. Look at this. It's amazing. <gasps> is that the hotel? Intense. Would you all mind signing in at the desk, please? Bro, is this a hotel? This isn't everything. I'm sure the rest is almost here. I'll, I'll make sure it gets to your rooms. Kate's makeup case is slowing it down. Erin, cigarettes. Blue backpack. Settle in, and I'll meet you all at dinner. Why is he, like, rushing, like... Eddie. Mr. Dumas, I cannot say thank you enough times. This is truly fantastic. I told you all this was a good plan, didn't I? <laughs> I told you. Oh, my God. What do you see, Fliss? Zero, one, seven, eight? Chat, remember that. In that rocking chair. Oh, it's the hag. It's the hag. Oh, it's the hag. There you are. Ooh. Busy, busy, busy. You've been out in a bottle all day, and I have to sit here worrying. Gone all day, and not a word from you. Walter White, what is going on? Hagalina! <gasps> Arr! This is my dog. Oh! <laughs> Sorry. You're jumpy. Oh my god. I think I peed a little. How did you not hear me coming? I was... I don't think we're the only ones here. What? Kate saw a little girl looking out a window at us when we were outside. That's who I saw, a little girl. Mr. Demet probably has family, a staff, maybe friends. Who knows? That said, this place does give me the willies. Willies, exactly. bro, willies. It's unique. Are you singing? Oh, yeah, that's my being scared song. This is my don't be scared song. Sing it and I won't be scared long. I like her. I bet. 
181. Uh, I think I'm around the corner. 183? This is me. Okay. Oh! Why do I, okay. why do I feel tension? There. Don't get lost. Scream if you need me for anything. Thanks. I got Ooh. you. Nothing to be scared of. Actually, hey. Yeah? Why uh -oh. don't you hang a second while I unpack, then I can help you find your room? Something about this place makes me want to use the buddy system. Yes, thanks. I'd end up lost, probably. It's, it's just a haul, dude. And here we are. Well, it's, um, cozy? Ooh. I want to say playful. At least we don't have to double up like last time. Mm, cozy is fun. If we have to double up like last time, we've married by morning. Ooh. You talk in your sleep. Not sure I ever told you that. Sure. What did I say? Actually, it was just a bunch of incoherent swearing. Oh. I was awake. I was reading Kate's social media posts. Ugh, that bitch. Okay, don't hate me, but she's been kind of nice to me. I mean, I think she's more upset about Mark than she lets on. Lies. She's a robot. Uh, where's the bathroom? Wait, what? Old school. Ah, uh, gross school. What do I have to pee in the middle of the night? Am I gonna walk in on Charlie sitting on the pot? Guess that means there's no mini bar either. Oh. Shows what you know. Ew. What is that? Wine. Genius. Oh, I feel like if we start drinking, Charlie will find out and lecture me and make me feel like an asshole again. Yeah. Aww. He does that. But we're not on the clock. Not until we're rigging to shoot. Which is hard to do drunk. <laughs> I'm not suggesting we get full on hammered before we work. Why are you doing that? I'm thirsty. Ew, also, what is that, though? You're cute when you're worked up. I know. Cute? You think I'm cute? Hmm? Ooh. Oh. <gasps> Ooh, want to share mine? Hell yes. I'll stick on my own if you want to share lip cooties. Thanks, but I can find mine. <gasps> Where'd it go? Oh my god, it's going to be a jump scare. It's uh, all the way against the wall. See it? Oh <coughs> you okay? <coughs> oh. Shit. You trying to scare me now? <coughs> no. Revenge? Because good job. <coughs> oh, she's asthmatic. <sighs> oh, she's asthmatic. I'm gonna say, you sure you're okay? You sure you're okay? Cause, yeah, maybe me scaring you didn't help, did it? No, but seriously, it's not your fault. I just, I, I try to pretend like it isn't a thing, you know? Oh, I like I her. I'm depending on an inhaler. I try to mind over matter it, but. Dust and allergies and damn. Just need to be more careful. Whoever is watching them behind sure? the mirror is gonna sure. like use that against her. I'm sure. It's gonna suffocate the fuck out of her. So uh yeah. Cozy. <laughs> <laughs> you gonna try that? It's probably all fermented and gross. It's not that bad. You're not lying. It's Picon. Decent vintage. Oh. And I want to say a strong, healthy amount of moldy sweat dots. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I hate you. You are such a liar. Ooh. I'm going to say, I wasn't lying about you being cute. Ooh, sorry. I thought you meant the thinking you were a cute thing. Really? Um, if my cheeks are red, it's from this wine. Not because I am bashful. I swear. Really. Sorry. Didn't mean to make you feel weird. I, uh, yeah, it's just, we work together and <gasps> Charlie is always on me about being more professional and- I get it. No, I mean, I, I'm not saying I don't appreciate it. Er Aaron, 
or that I don't think you're cute too. It's just, um... Uh, move in, bitch. Sorry, pushing the, the lesbian agenda. So sorry. Ooh. What are you doing? I, oh my God, I, uh, I... <laughs> oh, you bitch. I'm just fucking with you. I wanted to kiss you for months. I just was scared to make a real move. Oh, damn. Oh, sorry, sorry. Who is that? Oh, shit. Oh, jeez. What the fuck, Charlie? What the fuck, Charlie? You just standing there trying to listen in? What? No, I was just about to knock. What do you want? Did I, did I interrupt something? No, we're just talking shop. We're worried about the power grid handling all of our gear. Yeah, yes. If this place is running on a generator, we need to know what it's putting out. Ew. I don't care what you guys are doing. Then why are you lurking? I can't find my room, and I need a fucking cigarette. <laughs> oh? These funny shapes are numbers. They go up and down in order. Thank you. I've just been down there. Look, give me ten, then we should get a rough plan for getting our first shot. We have all evening. Can't we plan after dinner? I'd like to chill for a minute after the trek getting here. I want to be shooting after dinner. After You've dinner? Got ten minutes. Damn. Okay. We'll be down in a few then. Oh, Erin, I checked my blue bag. No cigarettes. That's where I put them. Come and show me. Maybe one of us is colorblind and doesn't know what a blue bag is. Damn. <laughs> to be continued, bitch. To be continued, then? Yes. Definitely. Oh. Good luck finding your rooms. Oh my god. I'm into this now. She's gonna see something. Come on, come on, let's go, let's go. Where are they going? They said see ya? Where the hell are they going? About dinner? Where the hag at? Oh, bitch, not the, the two-way mirror. No way. Whose feet are that? Oh. <gasps> oh, what? No way, what? Is that that girl? The redhead? Oh, Kate wanted you to have this. Breaking down walls, navigating the maze of anxiety. Are you fucking kidding me? I think she thought it might help with your stress, or- Absolutely not. I'm not stressed, okay? Do I look fucking stressed? Uh. That was rhetorical. Well, your cards came out nice enough. Oh yeah, embossing makes a huge difference. You old guys love business cards. <laughs> old school. You old school guys. I also put it on heavy stock and did the logo in foil. Damn. I should have had one ready for Mr. Dumet. Oh. Did you find them? I, no. I swear I put them in here. I don't understand. <sighs> Jesus. Um, I'm gonna be... Honestly, I'm not gonna let this man run all over me. Look, stop tearing around in there like a maniac. Oh. Be organized. Oops. It. Oh, I thought I was playing Look her. Fuck. Blue bag, front pocket. I made a specific mental note of it. 
They're gone, Charlie. Gone? Just like that? Are you saying somebody took them? I... I don't... Actually, I can see Kate doing that. Or Jamie. I'm sorry. Um... I'm gonna just say, let's just get on it's with things. fine. Let's just get on with things. I don't want to abuse this poor lady. This place is massive. Surely there is a pack of cigarettes in here somewhere. Even if they're ancient. You need them that bad? There was a bar off the lobby. There must be cigarettes oh, in the geez. bar, right? I mean, technically, it's not legal to smoke in bars, so... Come on, we're checking. If you find them first, all will be forgiven. Jesus, this guy sucks. Let's go find that fucking bar. This dude sucks hey, so bad. Mr. Dumet is in the back office. You could just ask him about cigarettes. Sort of. Hmm. And then I could help out with the editing. Pardon me? The editing? <gasps> oh! The audio mix. Look, I just think you've got Ooh, so whose much- Whose noise was that? You have so much experience. And it's an opportunity to pass that knowledge on. Right. Yes, I suppose it is. What was that? And an assistant wouldn't lose my cigarettes, would they? Exactly. Oh, keys? Right there? Do you still want to direct movies, Charlie? I am directing. Interesting. Jackpot. Erin, I found the key. Jackpot. Why don't I go check for a gift shop or something? I've already had one asthma attack today, and this dust farm is exactly what I don't need. A gift shop might have cigarettes. Exactly. a girl. Okay, search for cigarettes now. Hello? Hello, bloke. Wow. Oh my god! Ha! That's what amazing. What will it be, Mr. Dumet, sir? <laughs> what? I'll have a packet of cigarettes, please. A packet of cigarettes, please. Hello? Hello? A packet of smokes? I figured it was too good to be true. Never mind. Thank you, Robo Barman. Certainly, sir. Whatever you wish. Bitch. <laughs> no fucking way. One pack Thank left in that machine. Friend. Oh my god. Yes. <laughs> yes. Of course it wants exact change. Damn it. Well shit, we gotta find some fucking cash, love. Oh, what is this? Oh! Oh my god! Oh my god! <laughs> what the fuck? Oh! Here we go! Ah. Oh! Jeez! Yes! Come to daddy! Prairie? Oi! 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 I don't know what I'm supposed to do here. Life would be so much easier with that in my jacket pocket. Oh! 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 Five Nights at Freddy's. No, come on, you piece of shit. Don't do this to me. She's gonna slap his ass. Oh, God! <sighs> Antique rubbish. Give them to me. Give me my cigarettes. Right, you. That's it. I'm gonna go and get my key grip, and they are gonna kick the shit out of you. Hey, Charlie. Yeah, I'm still in the bar. I think it's dinner time. We should get everyone else. Okay, I'm coming. And I'm coming back for you with a fucking pry bar. Are you alone in there? Who's that behind the bar? What? Ooh! Hi, Mark. Mark is handsome. Hey, I had a thought on an intro segment. You want to shoot now? <laughs> yeah. If we get it shot and in the bank, maybe Charlie will stop rewriting everything I come up with. Yeah. <laughs> okay, sure. What? Nothing. Just give me a sec and I'll be good to go. I'm supposed to buy nothing 
is eating away at you. What does this bitch want? How many times have you cleaned that lens? I'm just prepping my gear. Really? Yeah. Always focusing on the detail, Mark. What is she trying to say? Huge risk and just do something. I watched you fuss for a whole week before you turned down that job offer, all because you had to take one extra train to get there. <sighs> say nothing. Hello? Jesus, you're on another planet. Why is she so mean what? to him? Let this man live. Get the camera and let's go. All right, relax. Jeez. Let's use natural light so we can do it alone. Didn't the lobby have skylight? I don't remember. I just want to look decent. Uh, we're not gonna say you look on any light. I'm gonna say nothing. This bitch doesn't deserve it. She's mean. This is where you offer up some expertise as the DP. Just thinking of where to go. Mark, why are you letting them all think I broke up with you? Ooh! I feel like if Jamie knew the truth, she might back off. I mean, they all just assumed. I can't decide if that's sweet or selfish. Or both. Ooh. Can I say something? Before we... Look, can I say Ooh. something? Ooh. We agreed that we're sticking to just the job. Right. Which is why you can't just roll up and drive by psychoanalyze me. I... Yeah. Exactly, bitch. <sighs> okay. They don't all wait. fucked each other. That wasn't fair. I'm sorry. We don't need to rehash stuff. Let's just work. I'm gonna say nothing. Nothing to say. Ooh. Let's go find some light and get started. Thanks for doing this. You're only asking me because your arms are too short for a good selfie angle. My arms are not short. There's gotta be a way through. So where the fuck are we going? We're just gonna go find light or something? Let's go this way. Whoa. Just come on. It's not that high. My vertigo is saying otherwise. Oh, he has vertigo? Oh my god. Don't worry, you look fine. What are you worried about, miss? Always be camera ready. You look amazing as usual. What is that? <gasps> oh! Possessions belonging to victims of HHH Holmes. Oh my god. Oh my god, wait, that was Marie's fucking necklace. Okay, check this out. It's his hat. No Ooh. way. H. H. Holmes. Don't touch that. Ah! Fuck! You okay? No. I just. This fucking thing popped out of nowhere. <laughs> Yeah, a fucked up looking one. <laughs> it can't hurt you. It scared you. It scared you twice. <laughs> Come on, let's not keep Charlie waiting or we'll never hear the end of it. He's the one who chose to be on civil blowing up on me when all I did was my job. I'm the one doing the talking on camera, not him. Come on, you came in hot on him and you know it. Not that you're wrong, but you know he meets anger with more anger. This is on him, Mark. Not me. I like Mark. I'm gonna say we're tired of watching you fight. The rest of us are tired of watching you guys fight. And I'm tired of having those fights. He's just jealous. Jealous? Yeah, he doesn't like that I'm the one getting invited on to talk shows. You mean talk show? Oh! Point is, I'm the one people see on screen, so they want to talk to me, and he's being a baby about it. I can't say half the shit he writes. It may look good on the page, but there's more to it. I'm trying to help, and he throws it back in my face. Because you're... Because oh. he thinks you're just trying to get content for your showreel. What if I was? Oh. He seems to think he owns us. Charlie does seem to think he owns us. He's so damn controlling. I don't <laughs> let him control me. Why else do you think we fight so much? Did you know Aaron hasn't been paid in weeks? <gasps> he told her that learning from him was his Ooh. own reward. Piece of shit. He has her running around town, picking up his laundry, doing his shopping like he can't do anything for himself. <laughs> Doesn't matter. One way or another, I am moving on from Lana at Entertainment. 
Ooh, honestly, I'm just gonna be supportive because I feel like we need to be away from this toxic bitch. Good for you. That's that's definitely the right call for where your career is going. That sounded very sincere. Because it is. Charlie would replace us in a second if he wouldn't be inconveniencing himself. He's using us. I deserve better than this. So do you. We all do. Mm -hmm. What a stunning performance. You should give up news and be Ooh. an actress. I was quite moved by all that. Oh, fucking Oscar worthy. You don't know what we were talking about. I heard enough, thank you. I know what betrayal sounds like. I'm particularly disappointed in you, Mark. Whatever your future plans may be, right now, you work for Lonit Entertainment. And Lonit Entertainment employees are oh. meeting for dinner to speak with our host. Charlie, I'm sorry. And Lonit employees are professionals, yes? So start acting like it. Oh my God, these idiots. Great. Happy? You have a future, and now I don't. That man is a goddamn child, and somehow we all sink to his level. <gasps> oh my God. Uh oh. Uh oh. Is this Mr. Dumoin? Or what is it, Dumet? Oh shit. Who is this? Hey guys. Oh. Think it's okay if we pour some wine? God, please do. Has anyone seen Mr. Dumet? Shouldn't we wait for him? Just poor Mark. I want to say, who doesn't show up to their own dinner party? Who doesn't show up to their own dinner party? None of you did anything to piss him off, did you? No, Dad. I haven't seen a soul here aside from the groundskeeper. He's probably cooking dinner himself. Ah, uh, Mr. Dumet! I love what you've done with your hair. We started on the wine. Hope that's all right with Dumet? you. Dumet? Yeah, that dude ain't coming. Wait, what? why? He saw all the snide things you tweeted from his limo. I didn't. What are you talking about, Jamie? He got back aboard the ferry and left. What? Ooh! When? Right after we got to our rooms. He just left. You're sure? Can't be. You must Ooh. be mistaken. I'm not blind. I know what I saw. Why would he leave? That makes no sense. They're in a big ass hurry. Guess you were right. There was some kid here. I saw them together when I was looking for my room. Oh my god. Another perfect Charles Lonnet plan comes together. What's our next step, boss? Swim for shore? Why would he invite us here and to dinner and then just leave? Ooh. Well, I'm gonna make him angry. Stop questioning my judgment. I'm about done with you all questioning my judgment. The man tells me he has artifacts useful to our investigation. Look around you. Did he lie? There has to be a legit reason he left. We shouldn't leave to conclusions. Guys, am I the only one who's getting really freaked out by this place? Mm. And by Mr. Dumet? As much as it pains me from the depths of my soul to say it, I'm starting to side with Jamie on this one. Thank you. Lower your voices. Why? He's not here. But that doesn't explain why he stitched out on us. He had to go Ooh. back to establish an alibi. What are you? You know. So when our bodies wash up <gasps> on the other side of the lake, he has plausible deniability. Oh, oh God, Shit. Jamie. Can you stop trying to make this worse? Fine, just don't come crying to me if you end up dead. What is wrong with you? I'm Ooh. just saying. Guess you never found your cigarettes. <laughs> the machine was broken. The bitch of it is, I did find a machine, but just like everything else in this fucking place, it's ancient and broken. So what are we doing? We just gonna... Sit here and pretend to eat. What's the plan, Charlie? Yeah, they seem shit out of luck. The plan? In true lawn and entertainment fashion, we're going to sit with our thumbs in our asses until a panic deadline looms over Ooh. us, and then we'll just throw some shit together and I'll save it with a voiceover. What? Well, here's to Topeka. No longer being the worst decision Charlie has ever made. He's gonna murder all of them. Hostile. We're gonna make them hostile. All right, enough. I'd like to propose a toast. 
It seems as if this may well be our last supper as a team, given how you've all been acting. Why does he act like their dad? Me and my apostles. <laughs> Just wait. Give me a moment. I can't decide who the Judas is. I've got so many options. And of course you're the martyr. You're going to find out very soon that you won't get very far without being a team player, Kate. Ooh, enough Sunday school bullshit. Charlie, what's your problem now? You know, you don't always have to get a word in, Jamie. You do your best work when you're silent. Trust me. Come on, Charlie, you want us to rally behind you? Stop treating us like crap. Ooh, I'm trying to make him mean so we can kill him. It'll be easier to kill him. You were the best damn DP I've ever worked with until Kate got into your head and made you Ooh! insecure and neurotic. That's not... You think you're too good for this, don't you? You think you're an artist? Fine. Go take some pretty pictures and see if that pays the bills. You can blame my mood on Erin. She lost my smokes. Cheers, everyone. She didn't screw up. She may seem all doe-eyed and lost, but she knows exactly what she's doing. Oh. Uh, then where are they, Jamie? Did oh, why would she do that? Ass? Oh, fuck off, Charlie. You're the director. You're not God. You're not the king. We're not oh, your royal God. subjects that must kiss your ass and cater to your whims. Okay. No, he needs to hear this. He doesn't give a single shit about our feelings, uh -oh. our careers, our needs. Fuck him. Fuck you. Ooh. Ah! Oh, this is just priceless. Of course you're enjoying this. Enjoying watching Charlie lose all control of his precious plan? Yeah, maybe a little. Enough, Jamie. Dude, you've lost the right uh -oh. to tell us what to do. Look at where we are. I'm just gonna say nothing at this point. So where did Demet go? We can shoot without him. We've all seen the place. Without a single word from Dumet, I have half a dozen setups we can roll on. So let's just do that then you're all free to bugger off in whatever manner you choose, okay? This is a mess. This place is creepy. Dumet is a weirdo, and you're nuts to act like everything is normal, Charles. <laughs> what is going on? They're recreating him in porcelain dolls. The hat? Whose hat is that? Oh, it's him. Oh, Aaron. <gasps> oh my God. What is that noise? Someone's crying. Is someone moaning or crying? <laughs> Who is that? Hello? Where am I? Oh, it's gonna be another fucking premonition. Ooh! No, we cannot let that happen. We cannot let that happen. What is all these noises? Oh! No fucking way. Now, what the fuck am I supposed to be looking for? God damn it. Oh! What in the fuck? What is this? What is that? Oh my god, we're stuck in there with H.H. H. Hamilton Holmes! Please, 
I don't want her to die! I love her! Also, why is this chapter so long? Oh! Damn it. <laughs> Breakers. Oh my god, they're about to make me go explore. Turn the power back on? What is this? Oh, babes, what is the number? Zero, four, five, one. <gasps> Ooh. Oh, great. Not this again. Per. Return to the lobby. Fucking thank you. Attention. This is a severe weather storm warning for the Greater Lakes area. High winds and heavy rainfall. What? Expected by 10 p.m. Central Time. Oh, Repeat. great this rain. Where the fuck am I? What the hell? <laughs> what the fuck is this? What the hell? <laughs> I actually really like this game. Not this. What is this? Oh, it's a cassette. Ooh. <laughs> ah! oh my Dad. God. Where's the PA when you need one? Gotta be smarter than the chair, boss. Yeah, yeah. Where the hell is everyone? It's a two person job to pull Kate away from her mirror. You know what? I'm gonna be reflective. Hey, sorry if I stirred shit up at dinner. I didn't mean for it all to end up on you. Don't worry, I get it. I'm the boss. Angst rolls uphill. Forget about it. Cool, thanks. <gasps> shit. What the hell? Oh no! Wanna be like, get me out of here! Get me out of here! I can't see a thing! Door is stuck! Break it open! It's not buzzing! <gasps> oh my god! How do we get her out? Aaron? It's okay. We're right here. You're not hurt, are you? Um, I'm gonna say I need my inhaler. I, I need my inhaler. I'm gonna ask my tax. What's your room number? I, hurry. Chloe, where's your room? Next to mine, down the long hallway for you. Aaron, I'm going. I'm trying to breathe slow and easy. Bro, is she gonna fucking die? Aaron, feel around. Look for a latch, a hinge, anything. We need to break through this thing. Uh, guys, I, I, I can't. Go and look for something to knock this door down. Me and Mark are trying to force it open. Oh my God. <gasps> Who's there? Oh my God, stop. say uh oh uh, someone's in here hi hi guys guys somebody is in here w with me oh god oh my god wait what did i do could i, could I have avoided this oh <gasps> stop he's an asshole 
Uh oh. Um, bro, what do I do? 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 Oh! <gasps> Wait. Was doing nothing the right thing? Oh my god. You're okay now. You're safe. Did I fucking... What? Did you see him? Come on. <laughs> he... He was... Somebody was right there. In there with me. Eric, it's just a dummy. No! No, it was not a dummy. He... He had a hat on, like H.H. H. Holmes. Charles, you're working her to death. Now she's hallucinating shit from the show? I did not... Nothing bad happened, Erin. You're okay. No one is in there. Let's all just calm down, get Erin back to her room for a rest. I'm not Whoa. fucking tired. Let's go. <gasps> Come on, Erin. Bitch. That was a little bit crazy. Well, guys, that was the first part of The Devil in Me. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you all in the next part. Bye.